Dr. Pinosian here. I just wanted to touch base on a very popular procedure that we offer here in this office, but um, I found myself sort of uh, convincing people away from it these days more than running towards it, and that's Morpheus 8. Um, what is Morpheus 8? Morpheus 8 is basically a, an energy-driven device where a series of needles comes out of a, a sort of a handheld type of a gun, and it goes into the skin, zaps the skin, and comes back out. Uh, the theoretical advantage is that it will then create some tightening by heating up collagen underneath the skin as opposed to uh, creating a burn on top of the skin. Having used this device for a number of years now and being now very familiar with the technology, it is quite limited in what you can do. In other words, it's not going to take the place of a facelift. It just never will. Um, and it's important to understand that. It is a skin tightening procedure that does not work on everyone and does not work on every part of the body. Uh, when we're dealing with it, it's usually the face and there's going to be some uh, areas that are more prone to wrinkled skin and sometimes those areas can be tightened up a little bit. But if you're looking for a big lifting effect or anything appreciable, then Morpheus 8 is not your answer. It's actually a facelift done well and that's the what we usually end up recommending here in this office. So just a little word of caution about Morpheus 8, it is also very expensive. Uh, oftentimes people need more than three sessions to really see some level of benefit and that can get very pricey. So the, the economics of it are not there either necessarily for this technology. And finally, there is some growing uh, body of evidence to suggest that those people who have Morpheus 8 done and then ultimately go on to have a facelift, sometimes have some wound healing problems near their incision line near, uh, that goes in front of their ears. So just a little word on Morpheus 8. It does great when it's for the right patient, but uh, in general, it does not take the place of a facelift or surgery.